Get the sign in there. Monday. <laughs> <laughs> One rep max, clean and jerk. Time to get heavy. Why then afterwards is gonna be a little endurance test. That's coming up soon, right? So this will be a fun challenge. The road 2K, then double unders, then pull ups. How big of chunks can you handle? I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Tuesday, one rep max push press. So we get to add those legs back in. We've been doing that strict press. You've been wanting to use your legs. Now you can. Then a wad is going to be a descending ladder of some American kettlebell swings and uh, press or handstand push-ups. Okay, this is a burner. Just push through and uh, you'll be fine. Wednesday, one rep max power snatch. We're going to a wad. It's a little more methodical in its pacing. Looking for big chunks on all the reps there for that. Five rounds. We've got wall balls, power snatches, and then either pull-ups or muscle-ups. Don't allow yourself to break it up too much. Try and knock out big sets, then rest in between movements here. That's the goal for this particular watt. Done. One rep max, power clean. Just a power clean, okay? Then, a little bit of on the minute work. You're doing this all within the one minute. You're gonna start with some push-ups. Then you're gonna go into hang power cleans. These movements have to stay unbroken because it's all in one minute. It's kind of like death by but instead of starting with one rep, we're gonna start with more reps. And you've gotta go unbroken. If you end up kind of dying off early, we want you to take one minute off and then continue until the 10 minute mark. Friday, we're gonna hit that three rep max back squat. Honestly, don't even worry about your one rep max that we hit last week. I'd expect that some people will get close to 90 or 92 and a half, maybe 95% of the one rep for three reps. That's going to be exciting to watch. The wad's a little split up. We're hitting the baseline wad, which we haven't touched in a while. It basically is just going to get our heart rate jacked up until we rest and then come into a next shorter wad, but a much more painful wad. So the faster you are on the baseline wad, the better, because you get a little more rest before we hit this box jump over and the front squat deal. Either way, you're going to get your butt kicked that day on Friday. That's the goal. Scale that second wad so you get at least one round per minute, but some people should be shooting for about nine rounds which is crazy and awesome at the same time. So Saturday is just gonna be crazy. I'm not even really gonna explain what's gonna happen because you're not gonna understand it. And it's just gonna be fun. Working with your partner is going to be the theme of this Saturday wad. You're really gonna have to utilize and strategize how you can work together. That's all I'm gonna say. We'll, we'll see you on Saturday, all right, later. We're doing it this way. Monday. <laughs> yeah, I done Monday, it's over. Are we walking? Sure. <laughs> Should I just do it selfie style? Selfie, that's fine. Let's, yeah. let's, let's go outside. See how this works. <laughs> hey, FYI, it's very hot on the roof. God dang it. What the hell are those weirdos doing up <laughs> on the roof with those cables between them? <laughs> Why do they got cables between them? I swear it, those CrossFit boys are just plain dumb. They're so strange. Just plain dumb. <laughs> see what it looks like over here. Hey, I'm just hanging out on the roof. Don't worry about it. Just take a Oh, I stroll. know what we should have said on the Saturday wad. What? To mention that we're going to retest that in the future. Saturday, the wad. We're going to retest it in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Done. <laughs> Done. Do you want to? Oh my God. <laughs> That's weird. Get a little, yeah, a little shot a little down, there. down there. Ah, 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 ah.